that? Oh yeah, yeah. No one could see your face. It helped a lot. They're like, you know, the guy just like talks to the crowd, addresses them what's about to happen. And I'm just trying to build up the the courage to do it. After that, I stabbed him. The blood was just, it was warm. And it sprayed everywhere. And the guy cried, was crying and screaming. He did not die after the first time. The second time or so, he probably just flunched over. That was... It's hard. I had to stab him multiple times. So, and then we put him up on a cross. And I had to leave the dagger in his heart. And then there was a sign that said uh, it had a code on it. And uh, like 166. Honorable opposition house leader. Speaker, this offense. individual is speaking freely to the media. The government has got to know where he is. And in fact, last night in the, po in the podcast, this individual described how he executed individuals by shooting them in the back of the head. He said that the people he was shooting deserved it, and he said, I know I won't be held accountable. He said that at least twice. He said this was all part of his goal to becoming a frontline fighter. Media are reporting this individual is in Toronto right now as we wow. speak. Can the government confirm it? If the media knows where he is, he's talking to the New York Post, why isn't this government doing something about here, this? Here. The Honourable Minister of Public Safety. I just kept thinking of the guy. I, don't, I, can, always, I can still feel having my hand on his shoulder. On his shoulder? Yeah, I just... Classic, yeah, you're holding him. I was pushing him into the knife too. I could still feel that. I could, you know, stabbing someone in the heart like that. I just kept re replaying the hand action of my hand going there. I just kept thinking of different things. There was a rush of thoughts in my head. I stabbed him. The blood was just everywhere. What the hell did I just do? I'm a psycho killer now. I didn't give him a chance to repent. I stabbed him. If I die after doing something like this, how will I face God? No, no, no. What the hell did I just do? Then I started thinking of my family. What if they were here? What if that had to be my dad? You're basically killing your own parents in a way. Maybe that jihad that I'm doing right now is the wrong type of jihad. Maybe... Mr. Speaker, that's not good enough. That minister and that prime minister had no problem talking about this when they were saying that these returning ISIS terrorists were welcome back to Canada right. and they were going to reintegrate them and give them poetry lessons. So, yes. no, Mr. Speaker, there are, the, the, the authorities are saying there are at least 60 more of these walking around the country. This guy is apparently in Toronto. Canadians deserve more answers from this government. Absolutely. Why aren't they doing something about this despicable animal walking around the country? The Honourable Minister. Mr. Speaker, Canadians can be very assured that the Government of Canada, the security agencies and police agencies of the Government of Canada are making sure that they know all of the facts that they need to know and that they are taking all of the measures that are, that are necessary to keep Canadians safe. The last thing that would... It, Having a hard time hearing the answer. If uh, I could ask everyone to keep their emotions down and maybe have some respect for the person who's speaking, that would be appreciated. The Honourable Minister. Mr. Speaker, the last thing that would ensure the safety of Canadians is to have a play-by-play -play commentary on security operations on the floor of the House of Commons. That, in fact, would endanger the safety of Canadians and diminish the administration of justice, and we will not be conned by the abuse of the opposition. The Honourable Member for Hamilton and Madden. The Honourable Member... Okay, I just... Order. Order. Respect. Order. The Honourable Member for Barry Innisfil and the Honourable Opposition House Leader, I'm trying to get your attention, please. Thank you. I, I, <laughs> order. Order. 